I head to Miami on Thursday. Hopefully leaving Miami today. My baba they confuse me always in stories. Say he gets a guy with a set of money from London. He doesn't see me like a Johnny just come. We're monkey the wall. Baboni just the child. Me, I go chop body washing. As long as you give me my bunch. So guys, we missed the shuttle. <laughs> This is my fault because I had my dad like set on after me. And I was trying to like, show you know the sister did to really check everything was correct. The other taxi. Guys, so bad news. We missed our flight. <laughs> we missed our flight. I was going at six. So at first they were saying uh, you have to wait till tomorrow. Then we went to go and ask and they said. We go on the 7 a.m. flight to Miami, but things that we're going to stay in Miami till Saturday, then leave Saturday to Dominica, like an extra two days. So annoying, but at least we get to leave New York today. So they said we're going to be on standby for tomorrow. So tomorrow morning, we'll just quickly go to the airport to see if we can get a seat. Standby means you don't have a seat and you're not sure, but if you go to the airport and if people miss their flight like us now, for example, then they can like put us in their seats. So we're going to the boarding gate waiting for them to call us. I've been wearing black, black, black all through. I wore black in Nigeria. I wore black from Addis Ababa. And I'm wearing black to Miami. Hmm, all is well. Guys, the devil is trying me this morning. They just talked to me again. I think I should go and check something, something, something. Check my documents. I don't understand. The devil is trying me. Bolo has gone ahead like 10 minutes ago. <gasps> but I'm going. I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. I'm angry. This is all spent. Can you guess who my sister partner is? Guess in the comments who my sister partner is. Hi guys, so we are currently in Miami and we're going to pick up our bags. So we see we have to pick up our bags and then check it in for our flight tomorrow. And from there we're going for a hotel to stay. What we'll see if we can beg them? They can allow us to go and left, go on a flight today. But I don't think it's possible. But let's try and see, sir. This has been the most stressful trip I've ever gone in my life. I'm going to leave Ethiopia Airways to the US. Not easy at all. Very really long level. But this name is downstairs, buddy. Get charger and my yeah, charger, my laptop charger, my phone charger. So I don't know if I have time for that. This baggage claim, what the right day? 26 I think. Long route because basically, 
Abuja to be so fierce, to be so fierce, to blow me, to blow me, to 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 Hi guys, hi guys, <laughs> good, good morning. So your girl arrived the US like yesterday and I said um, I was in New York and I was supposed to do like a room tour of room we're going to be, we were staying but I was so tired and today I'm also tired too because right now I'm in Miami. I'm sure you will see the whole backstory of why I went to New York and Miami. So right now I'm in Miami, that's Florida, and I wanted to show you guys how the room we're staying looks like. So we 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 booked a let me use the word a sleep in. No, the hotel. Like, no, it's actually sleep in. No, the hotel. So it's like a small um, hotel. This hotel cost a hundred dollars a night. I want to show you guys like how typically a hundred dollars room will look like. Now notice that the one in New York was finer. New York one cost one ninety for that night, but this one is. So, so I guess that's why it's cheaper than in New York one. So I think New York one is finer. So I tried to show you guys how the room looks, but pardon me. Um, our boxes are in the room now, and I'm not going to start arranging. I'm trying to deceive myself. I'm very tired. I want to just show you. You know, life as a, life of a content creator, you want to always use opportunity to create content. But before I go, I'll show you guys this beautiful view of this place. Hold on, I'll show you now. So can you see how beautiful this place is? I think this is the car park. Um, this is the way. So note that this is Miami, Florida. Anyway, guys, so let's start this room tour. So this is the hotel lobby. That will be the lobby. Let's say lobby. This is the work. The lab. the shower room here. So let's show you. So this is room three o six. So when you come into the room, can you guys see our boxes? a two bedded room which i think i like because the one in new york was like a one bedded room and we stayed on the same bed but this one we each get to have our own space i've chosen my bed there and this is his bed so when you enter the room the first thing you see is this table that's filled with our belongings already and our tv panasonic <laughs> so as like i might say that it's, it's it's quite on the affordable side of even if it's not affordable it's convert to naira but at least it's like a hundred dollars a night so once you enter you see this table and then you see the two bed we have a clock there we have an alarm something something i don't like the fact that their bathroom is not demarcated so this is where you brush your teeth and wash your face and everything then you now see the bathroom which i don't like there first of all there's no door here so if i'm using the toilet whoever inside the room can actually see me in the toilet it's like there's no privacy but I guess we're brother and sisters, so it doesn't really matter. So this is the sink, the the, the sink, and um, there's a hairdryer here, which is a good thing. We have two towels, and we have this large mirror here, guys. Then you enter the bathroom, and you see the WBC. The WBC. What they call this? Thing? <laughs> what they call it? You see the WBC. So I like how they put like five to I mean six towels here. We can do four. They have we have like four towels here and we have these two small towels. And there's this nice face painting, I mean nice painting here, which is nice. See, this place is very very it's a motel shop. I don't blame them. And this is the bathroom. So you open the door like this. I like the color, it's white. So this is the bathroom and yeah, and then so like i said you come out from the there's no door which is very annoying there's no door here then you see this mirror see this mirror and the wardrobe the wardrobe so the wardrobe is here this has a microwave and a fridge you carry your wine from there then the ac this was the same that we saw in our hotel in New York. I think that's what we use in hotels now. I like the room because they I like their color palette. It's green and like cream. I'll be white, I'll be beige. What color is this? Eh? So we have some paintings on the wall. And so that's it. So this is our little room for the next few hours. I think for the next is it 12 or 14 hours this is our room. 
so i hope you enjoyed this store and it's i know it's a very short one but it's all for content like i want to give you guys content so don't forget to like to share to comment to subscribe to my channel if you haven't this is a very stressful trip guys i'll just see you guys about when i get to dominica oh that's it bye guys guys so just get kfc we ordered kfc to the hotel and we didn't order water or drink because they are taking it we started me taking a lot of coke this trip so i just wanted to like stay away from it so we didn't order anything so right now i'm going to the vending machine to get water at least two bottles or one bottle so. hi so it's down the corner i'm not wearing anything on my feet only my socks and i'm so filled up i was so hungry and now i'm very very filled up hi okay. so I'm walking to the vending machine, Sha. See what I can get. I have like eight dollars. Eight dollars cash. Okay. So they have water here. Um, let's see what I can do. And if you're gonna problem, you can sue me, oh Baby, now I'm going for it I'm a star in my own movie, movie. Now introducing the new me And I bet you thought you knew me, oh I told him we could still be friends Now I'm going through a palate cleanse, yeah, yeah And the changing is the consequence Cause I'm looking in the mirror and I don't wanna pretend now I love myself more than you ever did And I know you can tell Damn, I'm vibing with the new me And if you're gonna problem, you can sue me Oh, baby, now I'm going for it I'm a star in my own movie, movie. Now introducing the new me And I bet you thought you knew me oh. Okay, guys, so I'm getting the water Two bottles of water one is like 175, so that's like 250. Yeah, 250. Which in Nigerian currency is like um almost 2,000 naira. <laughs> 400 naira water. But who am I to convert? Why dare I convert the currency? Hi, good afternoon. So we plan to go to Apple Store. Like time in the evening. I think we want to sleep now. So, I'm mean, so far here. But I'm putting my step. Guys, I want to lose weight and get to I want to actually actively walk towards losing weight. So, I think it's 3 or 6. Guys, this year has spent plenty of money. Mind you, this one will be alone. It's food alone is 50 something dollars for like regular clothes. <sighs> like, it's a serious. So I want to do like a day in my life in Miami, but I think I even have strength to go anywhere. I think I want to just sleep. Like, I want to just sleep all day. But I want to do a video. I want to do a video. This vending machine is very stupid. It basically threw. So I can't. I don't know where my shirt backwards. It basically threw the coins at me. It felt like a movie. <laughs> Hi guys. Good morning. Today is Saturday. I came to Miami on Thursday. And I'm hopefully leaving Miami today at 10. It's going to be like past. Like to six, yeah, I think it's like to six. So the thing is, there is a tropical storm coming to the island that I'm going to. It's, it was coming yesterday, and I hope that it has gone because they canceled, they canceled the flight that was coming in yesterday to the island. So even if I gone to the airport yesterday, they would have still canceled like the flight. So 
people yes that the airport opens today at 11. my flight leaves from miami to dominica at um, 10. so she will be arriving in dominica at like 1 she's going to the airport that will open by then so that's the update uh we didn't i didn't go anywhere yesterday on the first day obviously inside the room like i just rested slept eight watched movies worked on a youtube video that's my first part of my travel vlog Right, I'm going to separate this video into two parts. This one and the one of Nigeria to the US. Yeah. So, I'm sure I'll try to take you guys along today to show you like what's up, what's happening, and we in the airport, and we'll get our ticket, and we'll check in. I want to get it like three hours in or four hours in so that we can know that okay, we've gotten off our seat so that we won't stress ourselves so much. I'll see you guys at the airport or on the way to the airport, whatever. Guys, so we're about entering the shuttle. This is the shuttle. The thing is that my boxes have one issue and another. My black box, the trolley hand is spoiled, and my pink box, the carrying hand is spoiled. So I'm basically trolling one and pushing one. So, I so that my next trip I'm trying to make sure I carry beautiful working new boxes. And by God, my next trip I'm traveling out of Nigeria. I have I have to go what I want and who I want and where I want to go. So by God's grace it comes about. Okay. It's building the box. This is my oil making the fish. I just hope I pray and I know our flight will live in Jesus' name. I'm going to go make that today. Miami is a bit hot this morning. Miami is a bit hot this morning, so like Nigerian weather right now but without this yeah that's all thank you do we wait or we enter huh? do we wait or we enter uh, I live in six okay. six on the dots okay yeah. hmm? so I didn't do I didn't go out and I didn't do like a tour of the city but it seems like a very cool it rained all yesterday it rained all day before yesterday but it's a bit calm now. Guys, so I'm doing checking. I'm doing checking in and we're going to our gate. We are at gate D60. I'm looking for iPhone cord. Like, I really pray I see iPhone cord because I didn't go to Apple Store yesterday, but I was like, okay, maybe I'll find it here. So I really, really pray that I find the iPhone cord here. But right now, we're walking to our gate. I want to call my dad, so I'll see you guys later. Guys, I'm tired. All these cancelled flights, missed flights, all those things. It's annoying, it's expensive, it's stressful. Oh, it's most stressful. It's expensive for my father. Pity him because he spends a lot of money away right? just between Thursday, Friday. Saturday now I'll spend money again today till tomorrow because they booked us for tomorrow's flight. I can't find Bolu. Bolu is missing. <laughs> I thought he was behind me. And we didn't pick up our boxes. So our boxes are um our boxes will stay with them because that's, that's not my box is first with the tire because the hand is not good. Guys, we can't find the exit though. Mm. We've been walking since. Okay, I can see terminal slash exit. We've been walking since and we've not seen the exit. Oh. Man, this life, eh? This life is so, so tiring. Mm. I'm tired. Things are not the Dominican flights though, they cancel most flights to all the islands. Those islands that are hit by the tropical storm Fiona. That's one reason why I don't want to go to Dominica for this tropical storm for the king things. But I just need to go there so I can read my books, take my step on exam and do some other things too that school requires. It's tiring. This airport is so cool. No, I say let's be in the airport tomorrow. Bro. This airport is freezing, you know what I'm wearing my sweater, I'm still feeling it.
We're here for a blue taxi. Blue. But the shuttle? What about the shuttle? Uh, and you have to pay the hotel. Okay. So blue taxi, taxi is $17. Okay. You want a taxi? Yeah. Okay, we're here. Guys, we are going to the hotel. I don't have a hotel. Huh? I'm sure for now. Today we're going to go. I'm going to stay inside the room. I'm going to go. Even if you just do trek. My boyfriend said I should do my my husband said he said I should create content. I should not stay in the room. Any cab. Yesterday the cab entered. They said seventeen dollars to the hotel. We won't go to the matter of thirty two at least. Thirty something. Then seven, then five dollars for his tip. I was like, ah, but it's just seventeen. But eventually hopefully this one is saying flat rate seventeen. So hopefully flat rate is seventeen. So, I'm very hungry. I feel like eating Nigerian food. Like, I want to do a, 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 one or two videos in this hotel. I don't know. Maybe sit down videos, one or two. If I have like strength. Because I don't have any makeup or anything. It's just like my bare feet. I want to use for the video. If it's not fine, you guys manage it like that. But, that's good. So guys, we're in a new hotel. Hmm. This thing is so funny. I don't even know how to explain to you guys, but we're in a new hotel. I wanted to do a tour of this hotel too, so add to the other hotel we stayed. But I'm tired. I don't think I can do that. I'll just show you guys here. So I'll attach this clip to the video. So this is the bathroom. I'm in the bathroom right now. This is way bigger than the other one. There's like more space. I can't use my front, my back camera because like it's making this clicking sound and it's be hard to show you guys. So this is how the room looks like. This is the mirror. This is the bed. So I am on this bed. This is the table. We have like a wooden table here. And the TV. And that table. And I like the fact that you can see the cargo part of the airport from here. Can you guys see? You can see the cargo part of the airport from here. Um, which is nice. So right now I want to go to a Nigerian restaurant because I'm not gonna eat their burger or their chicken and all those things. I want to eat jollof fries and chicken or oh, amala safe. So if I come back and I have strength, I'll do the tour. I'll do the tour of the room, but if I can't, I'll leave it. Okay, guys. Take We just spent forty-seven dollars. That's like thirty thousand naira on transport fare to find Nigerian food. Never, ever, ever again. I also hope the food they have here will be nice. The driver gave you his number, so we can call him when we're done to know if he can. There's no African food there. It's Caribbean, Jamaican, African. They don't say Nigerian. See, Uber eats those people, but they don't give it to our side.
It's cheaper. It's cheaper than yes, way cheaper. <laughs> we found food. I'm eating a father rice. Okay, normal rice with a father sauce. Plantain. We need to get takeaway for this dinner because I'm not eating anything like KFC. I don't do that nonsense food again. Let me show you guys. Food. See how yummy this food looks. God. The news is still coming in my mouth. I need to feel it, you know, some food. Mm -hmm. After eating good food, our ATM refuses to pay. I mean, our ATM card refuses to pay. I don't know what's wrong with any bank. The bank is so annoying. So I'm looking for an ATM machine outside that I can use. So I don't understand what's wrong with all the ATMs. This is my card. We just use this now to pay for the cab coming here. So I don't know why it's not working right now. Let me try. This family dollar. I don't know if they have ATM inside. <laughs> because people say we're running away, we ate food and we're running away. And I like to pay for food, so I eat it too. Just to avoid things like this. Well, let's see, Sha. Hi, guys. So, I think I'm going to end this video here because I'm trying to make it. Because if I think if I continue, it's going to. My eyes are red. It's going to get to like 40 minutes. And I don't want it to be that much because the first one I'm open is already 43 minutes. That's the first. The first um, blog so the thing is um we were able to get our atm where what happened about the food thing is that the atm machine the atm my atm card wasn't working now i have a zenith bank usd dollar as dollar card which before usually works for like withdrawal and also we used to pay our hotel bills and transportation and everything so i don't know why it wasn't working at this woman's um establishment as her restaurant and it didn't work around the facility because even Bulu crossed the road to get to a, a fueling station and he didn't he didn't stay working with the client so what happened was that she found us a driver that would bring us back to our hotel which cost us fifty dollars again like bring us back to the hotel which the person did waited for her money so we wouldn't have to try the ATM machine here in the hotel and which worked. So I think the issue was, was from their maybe the ATM machines around that area because I was surprised because the one in here, once he came and he withdrew the money, it worked. So we gave them the money at least we safe because I felt like we felt so bad because the same we came to eat food there and we could not afford to like pay for the food that I received like. But the woman is Nigerian, so she was very, very, she's even from, she's Yoruba, so she was very considerate, she was like, okay, you guys should go, because we spoke about all sins and everything, we talked about school and stuff like that, so I think, I think she was, she's very nice, I feel my normal person, because not everybody will allow you to leave their store after eating without, like, paying, although the person that Dara sent us, she, she gave us, is her friend, so Dara will not bring back her money. So I'm going to end this vlog here because I want to, I just pray tomorrow we leave, the, the, we leave Miami, I just pray, I don't know what I'm going to do because that's like Thursday, Friday, Saturday, uh, I'll be leaving Jesus in tomorrow because I heard the storm in Dominica is clearing, so hopefully by God's grace, I'm going to pray about it this evening so that God can perfect it. But my mom, like my mom said and my dad said, it's better to be safe than sorry, it's better that we they cancel the flights now. And go for people get on the air and then the flight go for it has to go land in that place something like that because i know how the storm or hurricane or tropical storms are in dominica and other places they are not nice 
so uh what does i want to say so you guys subscribe to my channel i'm taking a lot of effort vlogging this trip because i'm very, very stressed but because i want to give you guys this content and because i know some of you want to see how it is traveling out traveling through the us and traveling to dominica for those people that come to dominica in january for january semester that's why i'm really, really doing this vlog because left to me i want to go actually do it because it's a lot of stress so yeah, subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get my 4,000 hours before the year runs out. So you guys should help me as I get there so I can start making money. So you guys should help me. And uh, what else I want to say? I think that's all I have to say. So um, the next vlog will be from Miami to Dominica. Maybe I'll show you guys how the flight is and everything. And everything and everything. Right now, I want to edit this video. Upload it on because Wi-Fi in this hotel is for fun and the Wi-Fi in the previous hotel is still today. So I want to edit this video, upload it on YouTube, and then I want to sleep because we leave here at six o'clock tomorrow because our flight is at nine. We've already gotten our boarding pass, so it's just for us to go to the gate and check check in and be bored. Okay, guys, have a great day. See you in my next vlog. Bye.